Hi there, this is Ranjit and in this video we're going to do the unboxing and have a first look at the iPad Air. Um, the version that I have is a 16GB 3G version. Uh, the iPad Air comes in actually two varieties, the Wi-Fi only version and Wi-Fi plus 3G. And the capacities again differ. They start with 16GB, uh, it goes to 32, 64 and all the way up to 128 gigs. And I just want to thank Fezzi Communications for providing this uh, unit for testing. So let's do the unboxing and uh, this is the iPad Air itself. Let's take it out. Actually, I have uh, already set this up so that we don't waste time and also compare it with older iPads. So this is the iPad Air and let's see what else do we get. Again, we get minimalistic things. We get the lightning connector and this is the power adapter. That's all you get and a little bit of documentations inside this. So pretty spartan uh, boxing. So let me put the box to the side and the biggest thing about this iPad Air is uh, it's actually a lot smaller compared to the older iPads and it's also actually a lot lighter. The Wi-Fi only version weighs just 469 grams and the Wi-Fi plus 3G, the one we have, weighs 478 grams. Compare that to the original iPad, uh, this is the original iPad, iPad 1 and as you can see it still works <laughs> and uh, this one uh, used to weigh a whopping 680 grams. Uh, I also actually have the iPad 2 also and uh, this also works currently using this one also as you can see it works perfectly uh, and this weighed 601 grams. Uh, the iPad 3 which started the retina screens uh, weighed 652 grams so this iPad Air weighs considerably less is just uh, 469 grams for the Wi-Fi version so they Apple did an incredible job and also if you notice uh, compared to the original iPad it is a bit uh, what do you say sm uh, smaller than the width actually the whole bezel this part has been trimmed so actually it's easier to hold I would say and uh, let me give you a physical overview uh, we have the toggle switch over here, we have the volume rockers and as this is the 3G version we have a SIM tray, uh, the iPad mini also accepts the nano SIM and on the bottom we have uh, the speaker grill and this is the lightning connector that will be used for charging and syncing this tablet. On this end actually we have nothing and on the top we have the 3.5mm headphone jack and uh, if you're using the, just the Wi-Fi version, this will be again in metal because this is, is the 3G version. This is the antenna. That's why this is in plastic. We have a rear facing 5 megapixel camera and this is the power on off button. Again, one more thing uh, that I noticed is that the Apple logo is shiny on this one. In earlier iPad's full version, it was not shiny and it just says iPad over here. And moving towards the front, we have the 1.2 megapixel camera and this can record video in 720p HD and FaceTime HD. And on the bottom, we have the Iconic uh, Power, uh, what do you say, home button. And let's unlock this device and we see the gorgeous uh, Retina screen. Uh, it's a 9.7 inch IPS grade screen with a resolution of 2048 by 1536. That comes to a PPI of 264 and as you can see the screen is gorgeous. I'm tilting the iPad to extreme angles and then also just notice how beautiful it looks. And this iPad Air comes uh, default by iOS 7 and as you can see I've set the brightness to pretty low. It can go pretty bright like this and as you can see it's really bright. Let me lower it back. And uh, as I've told you, I've already set it up and uh, I've set up my Wi-Fi and also I have enabled the location settings and CD settings. Again, I have to say the screen quality is gorgeous. And uh, let me fire up the web browser. We have the Safari web browser and uh, this is the tech 2 bus website. Again, if you notice how uh, easily it's able to handle it and everything works beautifully. Let's open up uh, one of these videos. We have a YouTube video embedded and let's see how it uh, handles it. Let's open this one. And uh, Hi there, this the is speakers Raji. are also improved. Stereo. They are stereo speakers now. Sony XPSC, which is a mid-range Android phone. So let's do the in-depth review for the Sony Xperia. C. And as you can see, 
again see the viewing angles are great so let me get out of this one what comes inside the box you can check out the other video i've made other videos also about sony xperia c and uh, let's move to another website let's for example let's go to readf again just notice the speed at which it loaded again see the pinch to zoom gesture crazy fast uh let me move to some other tab for example let's move to business again just notice how quickly it load it's the web page is really like blazingly fast that it's loading the uh what do you say web pages so that's for the web browsing very fast and uh, you have the app store you have tons and tons of apps you can download uh again you don't have a lot of apps that are pre-installed and this is the 16 gb version so let's look at how much space is available out of the box i have also enabled siri voice assistant i'll just show you that a bit later and these are the general settings you can set the lock rotation etc all the settings let's look at about and out of that 16 gb you get 12.1 gb of available storage for you so let me get out i've also set up the location services hence siri is working uh you just press the home button for a while and siri starts to work so let's check that out what's the weather like looks like nice weather coming up between today and monday up to 30 degrees celsius so as you can see that also worked pretty well and uh, the speaker quality is also pretty nice again as i told you it has stereo speakers at the bottom we have two speakers and let us try one more question what's the weather in goa it's going to be hot and sunny in panaji between today and monday with a high of 33 degrees celsius so as you can see that works great and uh, we can also switch on and switch off for toggles for example switch on bluetooth Okay, I turned on Bluetooth. Switch off Bluetooth. Okay, I turned off Bluetooth. So as you can see, uh, with iOS 7, Siri also has been improved. So that's it for now for this quick look at this iPad mini. Also, it's actually pretty slim. Uh, it's just uh, uh, 7.5 mm. So that's it for now for this quick unboxing of this iPad Air. Thank you for watching this video. This is Ranjit and I hope to see you in my next video.